Did you know, virtually all vessels traveling up our rivers and throughout our communities from U.S. city to U.S. city are American-made, American-crewed, and American-owned. Congress requires this in a law known as the Merchant Marine Act, also known as the Jones Act. Like similar laws for our airlines and other modes of transportation, these laws promote American national and homeland security, as well as ensure the safe and reliable transportation of goods between U.S. cities. Without the Jones Act and vibrant maritime fleet, U.S. shipyards and expertise needed to build and repair our warships would be in jeopardy, and we could have to rely on foreign ships and foreign crews to provide for our own armed forces. Because of this, some very important people have stressed the critical importance of the Jones Act to both national and homeland security. But it's not just about security. The Jones Act also helps power the U.S. economy, affecting each and every American citizen in every community by creating more than 500,000 family wage jobs and transporting the goods that we use every day. The Jones Act is always applied to the movement of U.S. cargoes to and from Puerto Rico, given its unique position as part of U.S. Customs territory. When others are leaving Puerto Rico, American maritime companies are doubling down on the island's future by investing over $1 billion in state-of-the-art vessels and infrastructure and creating thousands of private sector jobs in Puerto Rico and on the mainland. The result is an enhanced, efficient, and reliable delivery system for supplying the island, as well as a low-cost way to send goods from the island to the U.S. mainland. New economical and environmentally friendly vessels deliver fresh goods and products on a dedicated trade route that utilizes high-efficient logistics equipment to provide cost savings to Puerto Ricans in their local stores. In fact, retail prices of goods in Puerto Rico are essentially the same as on the mainland. A can of soup shipped to Puerto Rico costs the same as it does on the mainland. And contrary to some misguided claims, there's nothing preventing Puerto Rico from importing and exporting goods to and from the rest of the world on ships of any flag. Some want to eliminate the Jones Act without recognizing the consequences. Without the Jones Act, foreign vessels and foreign crews could sail within the U.S., transporting hazardous or unknown materials, weakening our national and border defense. Without the Jones Act, the country would lose thousands of skilled shipbuilding and mariner jobs that our country must retain. Any vote to change the Jones Act for Puerto Rico or otherwise, is a vote against national security, homeland security, economic security, and the men and women of American maritime. To learn more about how critical the Jones Act is to our communities, visit www.americanmaritimepartnership.com.